Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss a minute of Colorado Martini. So many families come into town for the Polar Express, which is right behind me. I'm waiting for the train to come past me so I can get some really good pictures. But it's really cold in Durango right now. So if you do come, make sure that you dress appropriately. The one thing about Southwest Colorado right now, is since I've lived in Colorado, this area has been in drought. So this is really well, this is welcomed. I mean, it really is. They really need the snow and they really need the water. So I don't mind standing in the cold right now. But the train should be coming right past me. It's right here right now. So let's take a look. Uh, we're taking our train ride tomorrow, but it's really cool because you can stand just outside the station and take wonderful pictures of the trains coming out. different schedules year round so make sure you check their website when you come make sure you check out the railroad museum you want to follow this yellow line um, from the depot all the way to the museum and it's kind of neat because you get up close to some of these cars and it is free so this is still a working roundhouse on the other side of the museum. You can actually hear machinery going on.
So this is just amazing. You definitely have to do this. Um, it is just, the pictures I think tell, you know, the story of how beautiful it is. So we've done it in the summer. We're now we're doing it in the winter time for the first time. Um, it just snowed yesterday. And so the mountain peaks and the river are just amazing. Um, just make sure that you bundle up. Make sure that you order a box lunch. It's worth the money to do. Um, they'll have it all ready for you. Um, and dress warmly. And just dress warmly. Our <laughs> daughter is in a jean jacket and tennis shoes, even though I told her to bundle up. And so she's inside the warm car. The cars are heated. It's not like it's balmy in there, but they are heated. Um, but definitely wear layers. Um, so you don't have to wear your hat and your muffler and everything when you're in the in the car but it's it's amazing and it's great that you get out and you get to get pictures with the cars and the engine and stuff and the staff is just wonderful But this is just really nice. We've opted to eat inside the car instead of at the picnic tables here because it is pretty cold out. Um, I don't know what the temperature is. It's probably between 20 and 30. Um, but as long as you're bundled up, it's, it's fine. Um, it's not any colder than when you go skiing. But it's just beautiful. And you just, you have to you have to take the train, it's just wonderful. Make sure when you buy tickets that you get um, a window seat that is on the river side. Um, you'll get your best pictures. They have this nice bonfire for us. You can come in here and eat lunch. Winter Wonderland. It's absolutely beautiful. This is so worth it. You have to do this. So it's absolutely beautiful. We're walking where we're going to go eat our box lunches that we purchased before we got on the train. They had them ready for us and everything. They have a bomb fire. Um, everybody's having snowball fights. It's actually very pleasant and absolutely beautiful.
That's why it's a narrow gauge because it is a narrow platform that you're riding on. You are right up against the rocks. Wow. It is a narrow gauge. <laughs> oh my goodness. Make sure to catch all our videos on the beautiful Rocky Mountain State of Colorado.